MP Pang Non Konyak on Friday graced the concluding event of the 35th Biennial Conference of the Home Science Association of India at the Auditorium of the College of Postgraduate Studies in Agricultural Sciences, Central Agricultural University, Umiyam Reboy District, Meghalaya. Along with MP Professor P. Das, former DDG ICAR Agriculture Extension, was the guest of honor. Speaking at the event, as Pangnon Konyak acknowledged the evolving role of women in society and commended the organization's commitment to showcasing the potential of home science in the country's development. Also mentioned about Vixit Bharat at 2047 to integrate the youngster building developed India. The conference also recognized outstanding contributions to research in home science with awards. Fenny Lefferty Karpuri received the Young Scientist Award, Dr. Natasha R. Marak received the Mid-Career Scientist Award, and Dr. Rekha Vyas received the Senior Scientist Award. Several researchers were also appreciated for their contributions to research in home science. I feel humbled and honored to be a part of this conference because these people who have gathered here are the silent people who are going to take India towards Amrit Kal. When India achieves our Vixit Bharat Amrit Kal in 2047, the India that we are living now is very different. And when it achieves that, your contributions will matter a lot. And I really feel very encouraged seeing the faculty members, the professors, you know, seeing the seniors, the present molders of and shapers of our future and the students, the bright young minds, and what you're doing now is really going to make a difference because this world of technology that we live in, AI, artificial intelligence, is going to be a huge factor. And when artificial intelligence comes to the forefront, subjects, sciences like home science, will be the humanizing factor which connects humanity and technology. So this science is something which is very important. Maybe it has not received its due recognition, but this is something which will grow and have a huge impact in the future. Because as India works towards Amrit Kal, and as mentioned by our eminent speakers earlier, guest of honor, the five trillion economy that we are aiming for. For that, India needs to work a lot and our Honorable Prime Minister Mod Narendra Modi's vision, different schemes of the government has been aiming at this. We have Poshan Abhiyan, we have different, different schemes which looks into health, which looks into, for example, especially for women. I accepted this uh, invitation to be a part because they told me specifically that women scientists are coming. And I thought this is such a great opportunity because women make up for more than 50% of this country's population. And for women, it is very exciting for us to be living in this time because under Honorable Prime Minister Modiji, women are now getting the place in society and we're getting that space in nation building that we never got before. In the present context, I would like to say that this is an startup era. If we are going to think about the household, so all the household have a kind of startups. They are searching and researching, and every day preparing the good food for the family members. Not only a similar kind of food daily going to prepare in their kitchens, but every day they are trying to also change. Means they are applying their brains for changing the taste or flavor of our food. It's so that all of you are a good scientist. But what is required in the present context? 